What's up, YouTube? And welcome to another music reaction with me, Dyke Martinall. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, so today's recommendation comes from my Discord. Checking my phone, checking my phone, checking my phone, phone. This comes from Tamashi, who has recommended me to check out another Dead Man track called This Day, This Rain. Cool. Now, I have checked out two songs for this band before. One called Follow the Night Light. And what was the second one called? I think the second one um, had... Uh, Japanese sounding name. Uh, Seija no Caution. Uh, and both songs were really cool. They were like a mixture of like severe melancholy but with kind of up like semi uplifting music so it was like a good contrast. Uh, so yeah no um, enjoyed this band so far so looking forward to checking out another one. Uh, but yeah before we get into it though if you do want to subscribe that makes you like better than the person to the left of you. Uh, if there's no one there, it makes you better than the person in the house next to you. Uh, if you do want to put a, no, hit the bell, that makes you, um, better than your school principal. And if you do want to put a like on my face, that better, makes you better than the person that you thought was like a prick in high school. But you always thought, oh, that person's more popular than me. And if you were that prick, that makes you as good as you are now. <laughs> Okay, now let's check out some dead man. Dead man. sound and bass. Yeah, so this one's a bit different for me than the last two because like I, I said with the last um, two songs that I've checked out, it's been a mixture of like sorrow-filled vocals but semi-uplifting music. Now this is a really melancholy song, both musically and vocally. Um, one thing, um, I've probably mentioned this uh, in a roundabout way in some of my previous reactions for this band. Um, but they've got really interesting film clips. Um, so I'm always sort of captivated by, even though like I don't speak Japanese, but like the story in my head that goes on when I see like the imagery, like it's very, um, very arty. Like it's avant-garde, um, am I even saying that right? But is that kind of like, yeah, you, you know what I mean? It, it's very, very arty um, and yeah. <laughs> Alright, enjoying it. Let's let's keep watching.
Nice. Yeah, now that one was, um, that one was definitely different from the last two I've checked out. Uh, again, a lot of the funky element came out of it and a lot of the uplifting parts musically that contrast with the, um, somber vocals were not really there. Where well, this was really kind of bleak sounding. Um, and that's probably the heaviest I've heard Dead Man um, at the end of this uh, track where it's sped up and, you know, the music intensified. Um, this sounded like, um, you know, the imagery obviously looked tragic and they're out in the snow and they're dragging themselves along the snow and then there's, um, looks like a makeshift grave. Um, and then there's the part where he's in the room and he's looking like, um, and I know everybody... When you see someone with makeup and, and stuff like that, everybody's like Marilyn Manson, but he's kind of looking like Marilyn Manson in the corner of a room, especially with that tall kind of look that Marilyn Manson may have done like um, in The Beautiful People. Um, yeah, so I forgot what my point was there. But no, no yeah, I, I guess my point there was like the imagery looked very, very bleak, but the song sounded very, very bleak. Um, and you know, I know this band, um, as, as far as I believe this band, usually their songs are on the darker nature of, you know, the human experience. So that definitely makes sense. But yeah, th this one didn't seem like there was any room for, hey, things might get better. It was kind of like, yep, we're in the shit. <laughs> but no, that was really, really cool. Um, I like to see a different side of this band, or like a slightly different side, as in like, you know, it, it took away that Smashing Pumpkins, Red Hot Chili Pepper vibe slash bleak, and just was bleak. <laughs> nah, that was cool. Thanks to Marshy, I appreciate that one. Uh, if anybody else has a recommendation, hit me up in the comments below. If it's something I've seen, I shall let you know. If it's something I haven't seen, I'll try and get to it soon. Um, what else? Uh, yeah, that link. That link will take you to my uh, social media. Uh, main thing there would be the Discord. Discord is a good way to make music recommendations. You can also chat to all the people in the, you know, my small community. Thanks for watching the video. I'll catch you next time.